Yeah, so let's talk about the big event you guys recently had. That had to have been spectacular. Well, this was, I got to tell you, uh, we were all nervous going in. You know, uh, this was a juvenile diabetes benefit. Uh, a friend of mine, Cesar Vasquez and his family, started this uh, nonprofit organization called United by One, uh, which coincides with the, the JDRF, Juvenile Diabetes uh, Awareness and stuff. So, um they had this idea, this big idea. They're going to bring in every company in uh, Connecticut, which is where we're from. And there was one from New York that was actually involved. They're going to bring in every company um, in Connecticut together. Some companies uh, declined to be involved for reasons that I cannot disclose here. But I'm going to be honest with you. The, 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 every put in their legwork, everybody put in, put in the promotion. We had guys from each uh, company. Some of the guys cross over from company to company, but we've had guys from each company uh, come in together uh, and it ended up being, we had over 400 people in this room. Uh, a lot of money was raised to donate to the cause. Um, we had Fuego del Sol there. We had Sunny Kiss there. Every match delivered, I got to tell you, and it was just a huge, wild success. I know Cesar, the, the, uh, the, the organizer of the event uh and, and harry de villa who runs blood sweat and tears wrestling here those two basically were doing everything together and in, in promoting this whole thing i know they were nervous af uh for weeks to come day of the show you could definitely tell but once those doors open in and that room was uh filled up with over 400 people we knew that this thing was a gigantic success and there was just some amazing an amazing amazing night of professional wrestling uh for for a very good cause and you guys raised a lot of money too. Absolutely, absolutely did. So I don't know the exact amount, but I know that they. I know they definitely did. We had raffles. We had, it was. We we had the children involved in a lot of stuff. You know, I brought my kids with me. They sat there. We had gimmick table set up. I did commentary for a few of the matches. Each company that was involved had their own commentators, and I worked for two of the companies. So I got a couple matches on it. It was quite enjoyable. I had a I had a blast, and I think everybody in that room had a blast. That's so amazing that you got to do that. What is it about what is it about giving back to your community that gives you the most joy? I mean, you know, you gotta make these people happy, right? It'll make you happy. I like seeing people happy. I don't like seeing misery, you know. And one of the things about professional wrestling is it brings people together. Mm -hmm. And that's the other thing. It just brings a bunch of strangers into a room, uh, independent wrestling. And people will just, you know, uh, I've made so many friends through the uh, professional wrestling world. It's it's un, it's unbelievable. So all these people just become a big part of your life. The wrestling community uh, is just is just an amazing place, I think.